this is Hudson County TV, coming to you from Western York as I bring you an exclusive interview with Commissioner Count Wiley as he provides an update on the recall efforts here in the township. Well, the update right now, um, you know, there's been a lot of rumors around claiming that the recall was dead, it's over, and in no way possible. Um, the last two recalls that we've experienced here in West New York, when Albio Series and Roque did his, they all have gone to court. Um, and obviously Albio Series was successful, Roque had failed. But um, here we are now, and we're in the process. We're in the process of right now um, going to court for the recall right now. So it's still live and well. It's moving forward. I want the West New York residents to know that, to not give up that this change can still take place and we're doing everything in my power to do it. We have very good attorneys, um, Jay Yaka, which is a fantastic attorney uh, in Jersey City. He took the, uh, he took the motive to initiative, initiative to help me and uh, make this a possibility. And we have a couple other good people, very well experienced, qualified um, people that are behind this also producing. Uh, Fernando Jimenez is another attorney of mine that's been involved with the recall. And I want to let the public know we're moving forward and I understand that in January, around the 13th, we'll be making our first arguments with the court. What I understand is that there's a set two or three different dates. And then I guess what will happen is eventually they'll go up to argument the case, where they'll argue it. Um, when you'll have the defense and the offense together in one courtroom. But I do want to say, I just want to put the message out again. This is great. Hudson County TV was to make this possible. It's a great way to deliver my message. Uh, they've been very helpful here in, in West New York and the rest of the county. And I want you to know, again, the recall is well and live, and it's not over yet. But thank you so much. Now, Commissioner, uh, moving on again towards the date in January, um, you know, what's the sense you get right now in terms of the success rate that's uh, going to either entail this project or not? Well, you know, after the review that we did, so in other words, we got it back from the, the clerk's office. And what happens is you have people, they claim that are not registered, um, signed the date that they weren't registered, inactive voters, um, all these things, these are just all technicalities, should I say. Uh, an, a person who's not registered in West New York, but then what happens? We go through the list and we find them registered here in West New York. People who are inactive voters. Um, inactive voters, there is no law that says an inactive voter can't sign a recall. They may not have voted in the last couple elections, but by the law, they're allowed to have their voices heard. So that would make, again, the signature um, be qualified for a good signature. Um, there was other technicalities where the last three pages of the petition weren't filled out, but they were notarized, and the clerk had chose to throw out the whole petition, whether the signatures were good, whether they weren't. So that's where I'm trying to say, that's where she threw out 90 or 80 at a time. So again, going back to the numbers that I reviewed after reviewing all these petitions, we're right up in the number, anywhere probably around right next to 5,300. The goal is 5,317. So that's what we're going to court to fight now, to approve those signatures by the judge, in which will push up the number of the qualified people that were registered to vote here, and then it might make this recall very successful. And my team has other plans, other initiatives to make this happen. And this isn't the only uh, directive. There's other statistical analysis, um, signature specialists that we're going to bring in. I mean, we're, not, we're coming in heavy. We're not going to be coming in uh, empty-handed, and I'm here to win this, and I'm here to make the difference and the change here in West New York. Well, Commissioner, we appreciate the update here concerning the recall. Uh, appreciate, as always, a few minutes on Hudson County TV. Merry Christmas to you and your family. And same to you, Hudson County TV and all of West New York. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching. For more programming, please go to HudsonCountyTV.com. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter. For everyone here at Hudson County TV, I'm Fernando Uribe. Merry Christmas and stay classy, everyone.